This is Gordon Boydwell here with the CMJ TV Book Club. Now we're all together. The book I'll be talking about is Another Country by James Baldwin. So the book is about, um, it's about sort of several relationships that revolve around one main character named Rufus. He's a sort of jazz, bohemian, New Yorker, um, and the, the workings of the book are sort of revolved around a relationship he has with a woman, a relationship he has with his sister, and a relationship that he has with several dudes. Another country was actually, it was introduced to me by my sister, my older sister. She was like, you have to read this book, it's beautifully written, and it reminds me of you. And I was like, alright. I think this guy, Rufus, is sort of forced to deal with the tensions of race, class, sexuality, gender. Um, and all within sort of like these really complicated sort of relationships that he has with people. So I think my sister maybe noted the fact that like that's something that I, that's something that I want to deal with in my work and that's something I want to deal with just as a human being. All the characters in another country are so much more complicated than just their race, their sexuality, or class. They're so much more complicated. And, and in, to, in, in that way, I think it's just like, super postmodern text and I, I look at James Baldwin as being someone who's an early postmodern writer. Um, and I think that, you know, his his all the all the rest of his sort of characteristics are he, he's able to sort of uh, transcend. This book I think took eight years to complete. Um, and I feel like you get a sense in the book that he's like sort of going through this struggle. He's going through this this thing. I read a New Yorker piece about this book actually that said that he'd come so close to suicide so many times in writing this book uh, and rewriting this book. And another book that he did was Go Tell It on the Mountain, which is like the same sort of thing. I, I think that there's something there's something that you can sense from the book. You actually get a sense of like his struggle and you get a sense of his sort of um, his journey through writing this book um, that I think makes the book super powerful as well. I think the main thing that I take away from another country is just the idea that human beings are way more complicated than they're usually portrayed in movies and literature um, and that relationships between human beings are way more complicated than they're usually portrayed. I think in my music I'm not trying to make some kind of grand statement about anything. Uh, I'm simply trying to put forth my reality and my experience on this earth, you know. Um, and, and, and I, I think that the best way that I can do that is to just sort of not think too much about anything and just create. Um, yeah.